Hey folks, how's it going today? Hope you guys are doing really good. Just testing out a guitar here. I put this neck on this body yesterday. This is a neck that came in missing a headstock. I made this one out of mahogany and splined it onto the uh, the neck. It's holding really well and I think we're good to go. I haven't heard any cracks or weird noises, so it's playing nice and uh, good to go. So I, I did tell you guys that when I was fixing it that I'd at least share uh, whether it worked or not. So it did and good to go. So if you want to check that video out, you can. So, so while I'm here, I thought I'd do a video on the Elvin Bishop tune called Strutting My Stuff. If you've never heard it, check it out. It's really cool, really funky, good guitar playing in it and stuff too. Uh, so if you know the tune, you already know what I'm talking about. Just goes back and forth between two chords, just D and C. Okay, now I'm going to play it like this. F sharp. So what I'm doing is, you know, playing this D block chord, and I'm just taking my pointer finger off and replacing that where my ring finger was, and then I'm playing the A string in the uh, ninth fret. And it gives you that kind of sound. So that way you can get that little thing he does in there which is, so I'm still just sliding down two frets like this. Okay, so practice playing it like that for a while if you want. Played up here. That way I can get that in, which is just the B string on the uh, eighth fret. Uh, well, you start it on the fifth to the eighth, and then back to the fifth. And he really aggressively shakes the note like that. So. play both parts so you can play it either way it's fine but I just want to show you that that's kind of the main thing that goes on during the verses then it goes to G for the chorus it's it's uh, G9 It's like the Hendrix chord. So what we're doing here is just the uh, A in the tenth, the D's in the ninth, and uh, the rest of them are in the the uh, tenth as well. Okay. So what I'm doing is just I'm adding this note, which is the E string on the twelfth fret, and then back to the tenth. Okay. again on the C9 and then up to the D9 okay so that's the chorus section so it's plays over that and that's really what I wanted to kind of you know tap into here and share with you guys so over that chorus section you're gonna hear him play this it's faster than that obviously 
obviously. Now that right there, folks, is that's really brilliant guitar playing. He's making the no, he's making the changes, you know, happen. He's outlining those changes over those chords with his line. That's really smart and really catchy. That's a great hook right there. When, the first time I heard that line, I immediately went and found a guitar and tried to figure it out. Uh, there was no internet back then, but... So, let's go over it real quick. It's kind of tricky when you first start trying to play these shapes. So it's going to be three shapes. Here's the first one. D string in the... Uh, 7th fret to the ninth fret. Then we're going to go G string in the 7th fret up to the 10th fret. So then we're going to go to the ninth fret on the G string and then back to the 7th. Uh, so real slow. is in the low. Okay, here's the next one. Uh, that note right there is so cool. Uh, anyway, A string, 7th uh, fret, ninth fret, D string in the 7th, D string in the 10th, ninth, and then 8th. And that's the second one. So let's try them both. Again, that's A string in the 7th, 9th, D string in the 7th, 10th, 9th, and 8th. Okay, so... basically like the second one but instead of ending on that note we're going to end on that note and we're just not going to play this note so so it ends on a major kind of feel so here it is again Take them one at a time and then just work them out and then I'm still not playing them real clean yet either so really cool and that's over the chorus not playing that real clean either but Anyway, I just wanted to pass the uh, info along. That's all that counts. Uh, so again, that's a really cool song. And you can sneak both parts in too if you, if you choose. So again. That's so cool. It's just one note apart, you know, that's making that outline. It's, it's really brilliant stuff. Something to pay attention to for sure. Okay folks, this one's gonna work and uh, that was all I was really after. was just testing this out, make sure it's gonna hold together, which it does. And uh, we'll add that to the super strat wall down there, I think. We'll see. It, it kind of looks the part now, but I gotta clean it up and dust it off and get rid of the nut filings and stuff on it, but cool guitar. It's got a nice sound and it plays really well. And I like this neck on it a lot better. Okay guys, thanks again. I hope that lesson helped. Strut your stuff. Okie doke, be good. <laughs>